this procedure or this result is going to last a good amount of time, probably more than a year. So I'm going to basically kind of align the needle up with the tear trough to see, make sure I'm, I'm going to go in the right plane and I'm not going to go past her midline or go anywhere that I don't want to go. So looks like my entry point is going to be right here. Now, it's important to know the depth of placement. So you have the obicularis oculi muscle right here and you want to go above the muscle. If you think three-dimensionally, below the muscle will be deep and then above the muscle will be a little bit more superficially, but you're not subdermal, you're, you're actually still, I mean, it's a very thin layer, so you're, you're just subdermal and you know, between the skin and the muscle layer. One, two, and poke. Sorry, dear. I'm assessing my depth and I twist the needle as I'm pulling out. So I usually use about two to three per side. I usually put a couple of here too because some people you do have some hollowness right here. So I usually treat that area as well. First cosmetic procedure ever. So proud of her. Give a good hand for Liz. Thanks for being a model. So